hi guys thanks for supporting my channel those who are not subscribe my channel please subscribe it leave the comment like also okay and in this presentation i will discuss about the ltc's material what are the welding requirements and the inspection activities are there mainly for low temperature carbon steel material low temperature carbon steel uh, mainly as a minus 45 degree celsius uh, that it uh, impact test that have mainly impacted impact test properties in the cryogenic services they are mainly used uh, for low temperature services they are used for this material as a uh, material grade for piping is a triple three grade six for pi plate uh, a five one six dash six zero so these are the grades uh, we are using then for uh, welding consumables we are using for a filler wire ERATS NI1 that is nickel one nickel is mainly um, the elements to enhance the um, impact test property the same uh, main impact test property is the uh, main mechanical property of the LTCS material so uh, one percentage nickel ERATS NI1 will increase the impact property of the weld metal as also for uh, electrode e a 18 c3 as well as e 7018 dash one also they are using e 7018 simply we are using for carbon steel but dash one uh, it gives uh, impact strength property in minus 45 degrees celsius they are tested uh, consumer is tested the minus 45 degrees celsius for uh, er8 e a 018 c3 that C3 mentioning chromium, uh, moly as well as nickel. Nickel is one percentage. That is the chemical composition of the C3. Uh, mentioning that one. Okay. These are the welding consumer for LTCS material. Then, during the welding process, we will uh, regularly, periodically checking the uh, interpass temperature as well as the heat input value is most important as per the heat input. As per the WPS, we have checked uh, the regular heat input, uh, okay, electrical, sorry, current parameters. What are the welding parameters? Current voltage and uh, travel speed, we have to note it down. And uh, near the joint, we have to write and calculate what is the maximum heat input is coming. Then we have to check with the WPS also. It's not uh, in, uh, exceed. Uh, the maximum heat input value if it exceed the hardness value will be increased so the impact property will be affected so maximum we have to control the heat input as well as the interface temperature these are the two conditions okay uh, heat input uh, formula you all of you know that one just calculate that one and uh, compare it with the wps it's a basic one okay uh, then other uh, inspection um, activities uh, most of the oil refinery plants the LTCS material have the PWST requirements and 100 percentage RT also uh, have so as per the client requirements they we will do uh, so the basic question will be asked um, about the LTCS material will be what are the during the welding activity what are the um acceptance limit is there in um how can we check uh, the heat input value like that they will ask the questions so be ensure i think you are all understand about the ldc's material and if any doubt please uh, make the comment okay thank you